Well, I guess this is how we're starting it. Hey, everybody, welcome back to some more Like a Dragon Guide, and Tom here wants to tell us something, so we're going to listen to Tom. Tom, what do you got? Uh, excuse me, uh, Joe Yusan, may I have a moment of your time? All right, what's up? Do you remember me? We met earlier in the Coliseum reception. Yeah, I talked to you, like, for an hour yesterday because I was just grinding for money. Yeah, odd seeing you here. What's the problem? Yes, actually, uh, I'm here on behest, behest of the castle's four kings. Ah, mm. uh, you roughed quite a few feathers when you seized control of the castle. Meaning? Well, the four kings are particularly unconvinced of your ability to manage the castle now that the patriarch Nish, Nish, uh, is gone. Yep. In their own words. If Joyu aims to control the castle, he must prove first and firm, foremost that the that he is the stronger than our collective. They don't need to be suspicious. I got plans for the Coliseum. I was only after Nishitia. I can't say his name. I'm so sorry. (laughs) I don't have the leisure to spend my time micromanaging the castle anyways. Just tell them to leave me alone. My serious apologies, but I could... But could I trouble you to tell them yourself? Otherwise, well, I shudder to think of what they might do to me. Huh? I mean, there's a chance I won't make it out of there with my limbs intact. I hope you show me some mercy. Alright, I don't want to cause any trouble, so I'll handle it. Where can I find him? And they walk up. Oh, we got Red Boo. What? <laughs> what is this? What is this? No need to search for us, you god. You're so goddamn slow, I came here to find you myself. And you are. What? <laughs> what is that? What the heck is that? So I had to drink. This is one of the four kings or whatever. What? <laughs> Don Brody. What? 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 What is this? <laughs> what the heck is this? <laughs> A.K. Brody the Clown. Oh, a sub story. What? Brody Sama. I beg your pardon. I was just about to bring Ki- uh, Joyu San to see you. No problem. We'll just have to have a little chat with this guy. And now, we've crossed past everything's hunky-dory. I hate... I hate it. I hate this man. I... I am very... Very uncomfortable. You want to talk? Then uh, let me start by saying that I'm not here to meddle in your business. Look... Oh, what the... What? How did my controller... Whatever. (laughs) Aw, dang it. (laughs) Ah, you're right on the money, but you're the one who took down Patriarch him, aren't you? Whatever I came across, or whenever I come across the real deal like you, it's so hard to stop myself from messing around a little bit. Please don't, please don't say it like that, please. Why do you have, why? Why do you have a a freaking combat dagger? You have two of them. I see. So you had something else in mind when you said you wanted to talk to me, huh? Brody the Clown, that was Brody-sama, was called back when he was an assassin. Oh, why did you become a clown? Do you gonna explain that? He used to perform- oh, okay, now it makes sense. He's a strong man and a clown. <laughs> That's where he got the knife-throwing skills. Eventually he got ticked off and murdered some troop showmen. Is that troop? Whatever. After that, he escaped to the underworld, becoming an assassin and renowned for his blade work, and the rest is high story. (laughs) Hey, your info's outdated. I've got a new weapon to play with these days. Is it a bazooka? Oh, of course you have drones. Those drones! Where did you get those? Those were stolen from the Kiyosoto family. So, who the hell gave you those, right? (laughs) <laughs> I'm not messing around. Who gave those to you? Who gives a shit about stuff like that? More importantly... Are we actually gonna fight? Enough talk. I'm bored out of my mind, so let's have some fun, shall we? Alright, here we go. I'm ready. I'm ready. Come on. Swing first. Swing first. Come on. Come on, what you got? What are you... Alright, that's it. Oh, you're summoning the drone army. Jesus. Ah! Oh yes, I did this move. Let's go! I did it by accident. <laughs> Come on, Danny boy. Oh shit! Oh shit! I need to back up. Uh, 
Okay, I just needed to do that because he was gonna... He's gonna do... Oh, no! Ow. Okay, okay. Are you... Oh! Are you serious? Oh, God. Yeah, while you do that, I'm just gonna kick your ass, dude. Get the fudge out of here. <laughs> God. My goodness, I grinded a little bit for some health and attack bonus and some cool new, um, you know, moves. Or else that could have been interesting, wouldn't it? Wouldn't have been. <laughs> Not too bad, but I'm just getting started. I expect better jokes from a clown. Oh, shit! <laughs> Damn, don't play yourself, kid. Alright. Now it's time you tell me exactly how you got those drones. Mm. What do you got against drones? Uh, your gun gave them to me, told me to use them. <laughs> mm. Alright. Okay. Oh, who the hell is that? You haven't heard of him, Joyusan? Yuisama is the most powerful of the four kings. What? The most powerful of the four kings? The legendary champion who dominated the world's underground and combat scene... Uh, for up to 20 years. That's a long time. 20 years. He's never lost. Mm. Oh, that's right. He mentioned something like that. Said he was crushed by a man sitting on the castle throne. Which means that that guy, fella, is the one who defeated him back then. <laughs> He's got a, got a plan, you know. He said that these gadgets will safeguard our throne for years to come. He's got other gizmos too, like wires and shoes. You ought to see the eyes. His eyes sparkle like a kid with a brand new toy. Fine, but that's irrelevant to me. Those stolen goods don't belong to you. Return them now. Oh no, more? Oh my God! I just want. I just want. Oh, is this a nut? What is that? It's a freaking what? <laughs> I'm afraid here at the castle that sort of logic doesn't apply. So spar us. Unless Pratton... Wait, what? So spare us. Oh, spare us. Whoops. It's him. Holy cow, all the four kings gathered together at once. Looks kind of cool. Oh, dude. Uh, 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 there's a freaking Power Ranger. Quite the ragtag bunch, aren't you? Ha, oh, dang it. <laughs> so you're that guy. <laughs> I don't care if it's... Not the way, or I don't care if it's not the way things are done in the castle. I'm getting his gadgets back from you. Yeah. And I'm under no ob obligation to accommodate you. I don't take orders from anyone I can wipe the floor with. Oh yeah, you want to fight? You do look tough. Your droids are pink, what? Okay, so what? <laughs> For forgot your own words already? Is that not what you told Patriarch before our little, your little tussle? Oh. I agree with their sentiment wholeheartedly. Much like us, we uh, you have the spirit of a true warrior. And so, if there is something you desire, you must force us to yield. Then you can take it. So that's how it is. Fine. I'm all for that. And conveniently, the four of you gathered right here for me. I'll take you all on. Wait, joy son, even for you, that's impossible to win against them all. You may have defeated Brody-san, but he's the weakest of the kings. His power can't compare to the others. <laughs> Calm yourself. We're not so dishonorable to shame ourselves by ganging up on a single opponent, nor so foolish as to waste our talent on a fight where we can earn no profit from. If you're good at something, never do it for free. Wise words. I think your friend could stand to learn something from that. All of you, enough! Are you trying to make me look like a fool? I mean, you are... Uh, okay, all right, here, it's going to show up. It's going to say, you are a clown. Are you ready? Jody. Dang it. <laughs> Joy, if you wish to compete with us, first work your way through the ranks of the Coliseum. There we shall settle our differences before the crowd. Oh. Each king holds a platinum rank. This, of course, includes Dan Brody. <laughs> In the Coliseum, I'll show you what I'm really made of, and this time, come prepared. <laughs> uh, don't, do you find my proposition am, amenable? <laughs> amenable? That's it. Joe you. 
He could just activate a bicycle. First, tell me one thing. Did they sell you those gadgets? Uh. They did. What of it? Uh. As I said, if I defeat you, I will. I want you to return the gadget to him. But I got an additional exam er, bleh, thing. And what would that be? Hand over the family to me. Practically patriarch him. And I know. I want to know where they're hiding. And I think you know the answer. Uh. That family used their full force to infiltrate his shop, break his arm, and make off with his property. I'll see that they get what they deserve. <laughs> huh, very well. In our world, winner takes all is the law. So ask for whatever you desire. If you prove yourself worthy of the throne, I will hand over the family without hesitation and much more. As for myself, I merely desire to hold the title of the world's strongest. The world's strongest. <laughs> you seem, or you see, as though you may be considered a contender for that spot. And what I see, er, God, I am so sorry. And when I see a potential threat, I must crush it. All right. Well, what a way to start off the sub story episode by actually getting a sub story. I see now. So the man who's never tasted defeat. Seems like a formidable opponent. Indeed, I don't even want to think about what happens if I anger the kings. Don't worry, Tom. Thank you for assisting me. I am truly grateful. Don't mention it. Uh, meeting them helped f further my goals. And it's my fault you got swept up into this when I took over the castle. I don't deserve your gratitude. Be that as it may, under his rule... Countless souls are being obliterated at the hands of the four kings. Jeez, obliterated? You truly intend to impose them? Yeah, I gotta get his gadgets back and crush what remains of the family. Plus, I must admit, when I see a powerful opponent like them, it gets my blood boiling. <laughs> guess it's part of me never guess that part of me never changed. Uh, I see fighters like you truly live in a very different world than uh the one I inhabit. I have no doubt that the crowd will go wild for your battle ahead. Now, if you excuse me, I look forward to seeing you at the reception next time you wish to compete. It is an or uh, if that esteemed Joyusan challenges the long reigning kings, the stands will be packed as a fan. I am overjoyed at this prospect. I did it! <laughs> Yay! Oh, by the way, I went to the I went to the um, what you call it the the VIP lounge and someone tried to offer me this huge freaking sword. I mean, it's huge. It's ginormous. Four kings, huh? Never guess it would settle uh, settle things sooner or later. Besides, he asked me to. But it's getting late. I should rest up at Akami's house before the big showdown tomorrow. Boop -ba -doop -ba -doop -ba -doop -ba -doop -ba Wait, what do you have? What do you say? Do you say anything? What do you say? Oh, I could just... Oh, sweet. All right, cool. That's good to know. I just talked to him. Okay. Dude, that's in that's just that's just insane. Like they can't, like you should have seen I was just like sleepwalking cuz like, well, I want to check out the VIP lounge before, you know, I do some other stuff. And then I saw that and I'm like, "What? What? 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 What the what the fuck? What?" <laughs> it just blew the lid off my top, you know? And I mean, it was huge. It was bigger than me. The sword is bigger than me. That's how you know. Alright. So like I said, hopefully it lets us do the... Um, the... The side missions, because that's what we're gonna do. But if not... You know, we'll, we'll just do the story. It's no big deal. Oh, gosh dang it. Now I gotta do more talking. <coughs> Joe, you heard about your running with the four kings. How? Word on the street is Dan Brody gave you a thrashing. And here you're already up walking around. Huh? That's funny. I remember it happening another way. Brody is the one that got the beat down, not me. I guess he's been spreading rumors. I wouldn't have expected the most prideful member of the four kings was the supposed weakest one. So that's what happened. <laughs> All right. 
Guess I don't. I guess I do have a hard time picturing you losing a fight. Hmm. But the truth be told, I can't right right bleh, rightfully picture the Kings losing either. Well, it's fine. Whatever story's going around, I can't say I care. Now there's a real man answering the right here, right there. Cool as a cucumber, no matter what people say about you. <laughs> Anyhow, better get back to work. What'll it be today, Joe? You? Oh, well, I just stopped talking to you. I can't. It's time for some story time. Oh, Joey, I've been waiting on you. All right. You know, let's give you a gift. Here's some. Here's some smokes. Let's have some smokes. Yeah, I leveled up. And then we'll do this. Get me my money. Request. Oh, we still got quest. Oh, we still have quest week. That's right. We still have quest we can finish here. Nope, not doing that. All right, we need to go over here. I don't know why I set up the thing. I could just do a, you could just take a taxi. I guess this is to where I know where I'm supposed to go. Just in case I'm stupid. But I think I'll remember where to go. So, like I said, this is just going to be straight up trying to finish a bunch of side stuff. Just because I want to. And it's my video, so I do what I want, okay? No, I just think the, the side missions are just uh, much more, like... They're the funnier stuff. They're, like, the things, like, you know... Like, during the last video I made where it's like, Oh, no, not her. <laughs> Someone left a comment just saying, like, She's the final boss. It's great. <laughs> and it's like... That's why I like you guys. <laughs> That's why I like you guys. You guys are great. I think we're here. The place where Ryu's looking, Ryu looking guy showed up. Yo, Pops. Pops? Huh? Nope, not blonde. Though we were, though I we thought you were him for a second. You looking for somebody? Huh? Nobody's talking to you, old man. You, what? You just did? You, you literally just talked to me. What? You, What? You're after a blonde guy with silk back hair, aren't you? Whoa, you guessed it. <laughs> if you know something, spit it out. Just a rumor I heard. <laughs> Why are you being so shady? Look, look. If you know something, how about I pound it out of you? Oh, we're really... Guys, guys, come on, guys. Guys, let's not do this. Let's not embarrass yourself. Oh, good dodge, but I am ready. All right. I punched the guy that had nothing to do with that. Let's do this. Alright. I'm done with both. I'm done with all of you. Oh, I broke the sign. Oh. And then we'll deal with you real quick. Punch up in there. There we go. Alright. No one's pounding anybody. Well, don't say that. Don't Just don't use the word pounded. You know? It's like the word daddy. It's been crazy sexualized and I hate it. Damn, who is this dude? What? You're looking for Ryu Goda, aren't you? Pfft, now, what if I am? Why are you after him? Cause this here's our turf. We've been hearing that Ryu Goda punk's been stepping around here like he owns the place, so we came to put an end to it. A turf war between kids? Seems like, um, they don't even know who Ryu is. Get out of here. And... Try to stir up less of a trouble from now on. Where you go to, is it? Haha, <laughs> looking for me? Were you? Nani. It can't be. <laughs> <laughs> nope, not even close. <laughs> uh, what do you mean? I'm Ryu Goda. I'm the guy you're looking for. Good to meet you. Yeah. Looks like you. Know, this was a waste of time. See ya. What's this? <laughs> Seems like Mr. Big Shot over here is misunderstanding me. When I'm done with you, you'll be pissing yourself when you hear my name. All right. Well, <laughs> supposed Ryu Goda. Oh, you don't even have a lot of health. Let's just let's just end this real quick. All right, bud. You need to just. Just get out of here while you can. Oh! Boop! Oh, we're gonna hit him on the car again! Oh! oh. I get when I hit on the car. 
Oh. 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 Why? Why are you impersonating Ryu? Oh, well, the name Ryu Goat is legendary in this town. It's a great way to get some notoriety. I see. Seems like his boots are too big for you, though. Mm. Ugh. But that ain't the only reason I call myself Gota. Why is that? That's my name! <laughs> See you later! Only quick when he's running away. Turns out this guy couldn't be less like him. Hey, yo, real big, real fake. Oh, God! Oh, it's Joe, you. The Gota was a bust. It was a bust. Uh, turns out it's only some thug taking advantage of Ryu's clout. Ah, well, so it goes, right? While you've been out and about, I've tracked down a new rumor. Let's hear it. It's about an extraordinary scam. A honeypot. What's a honeypot? As the kids call it these days. Been popping up around town lately. What is that? The victim is invited somewhere by a sexy lady. Oh, well, damn. <laughs> but only once they arrive, they find a scary guy waiting for him. A guy calls himself Ryu Goda. I've been in one of these before. Ryu's running an extortion scam? The guy's blonde, of course, and he says he's got a long coat and a Japanese sword, too. Well, that's... Sounds like Mr. Goda's as famous as those as... Wait, famous for those as he's for his flashy blonde duo. Duo his? What? Duo his? Uh. There we go. <laughs> All right, I'll give it a look, too. I know I'm, at, I'm the one asking, but you're being surprisingly proactive about this, aren't you? No more than normal, so how do I find this guy? His lady friend seems to be showing up on South Shofuko, Shokifuko Street, so try making contact there. Will do. Alright, I gotta grab some, gotta grab some grub beforehand. Gotta grab me some grub. Hey, yo, I'm gonna buy all your stock real quick. I don't care, I got money. I got freaking money. Money, 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 money. Alright, we'll, we'll leave it at that. Find a place to uh, grab some grub real quick. I guess we'll grab it right here. I meant right here. Hey, I need some food, please. Ah, uh, we already grabbed that, so let's grab that. Order. I'll take... Crab Schwab 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 Alright Yes Thank you It tasted Amazing Alright so now We go Now we go Oh I should have got a million yen for that We'll probably get it through here Boop 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 Dude God thank goodness they allowed you to call the They allow you to call a taxi through the phone now Oh my god Oh. <sighs> so now there's another as do I right, bets it's obviously not the same Ryu Goda. Obviously. Not like the I meant the same fake Ryu Goda that was Goading around people beforehand. Are these Ryu Godas actually goating it up? Or are they all just... We're bound to see the real one soon. This is where Akami... Is there so... Oh, no, there's no one. <laughs> the extortion scam was happening. Oh. Excuse me, here, handsome. Oh! <laughs> oh! Well, that was fast. <laughs> Sorry, what? Anyways, what you up to? If you're not busy, uh, how about the two of us have a little fun together? Mm. What do you mean by fun? Come on, you're gonna make a lady say it out loud now? Just broke up with my boyfriend, I'm feeling all this pent up, you know? Pent up, you say? Uh-huh, like super pent up, you know? <laughs> I get it, <laughs> sure, I'm in. You like girls who are quick to get in the mood, huh? Anyways, let's go! Alright. Well, time to see what comes out of this. They just chicks dig the golden suit. 
they see the gold suit and they're like, oh, let's freaking go. A nice man with a gold suit. Whoa. All right, here we are. You cool if I shower first, big guy? Go for it. Okay, I'll be right back. Why you gotta shower now? That's a little sus. And here's where the climax extortion twist would come in. <laughs> oh, so you're the one who's trying to steal Ryu Goda's girl. Wait, it couldn't be. The blonde hair. The go. The jacket. <laughs> <laughs> nope, not a chance. You realize what you've done, you bastard. You're paying for this with your blood. Darling, oh, that man took me here against my will. Oh, no go. That goes without saying. No way a pre-hearted, devoted girl like you would come into a filthy, indecent place like this on your own account. Sure, yeah. Yeah, sure. Now, could you hand over your wallet and phone? Got it? Why are you dressed like that? <laughs> Say what? And why are you calling yourself Ryu Goda? Explain that one for me, too. Who does this guy think he is? Ass clown. <laughs> Those will be your final words. Oh, you are gonna get sauced up, my guy. Hey, we're just gonna end this real quick. Like, I'm just gonna hit you. Oh, never mind. I'm just gonna not hit you then. I'm just gonna hit you with one of these. I'm gonna hit you with one of these! BAM! You're done. You're done, son. Goodbye. Oh, what? You lived? That wasn't part of the... Here we go, here we go. Oh, wrong thing. We'll just beat him while he's down. <laughs> we'll just beat him while he's down. Ugh, ugh. Who is this monster? Eek! <laughs> Eek! I'm out. Looks like your devoted girl's a bit of a monster herself. Now, I'll ask you again, why are you pretending to be Ryu Goda? Well, 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 I... Am I getting a phone call from Akami again? Mm -hmm. Joy here. Any updates on the Ryu rumors? Yep, another dead end. Was just about to ask this guy why he's been impersonating him. That's right, well... I just hit the jackpot over here. I've located the Go Ryu Clan's hideout. hideout. The Go Ryu Clan's what? I'm out of here. <laughs> now is my chance. Ah, <laughs> uh, just tell me where it is. Sorry, where were we? Three goes hideout, right? Uh, I thought they disbanded a long time ago. More accurately, the isn't the hideout of the Ryugoda remnants who were plotting the clan's revival. You sure it's really them? This ain't a rumor. It's information. Uh, you think you've got something to do with all these fake Ryus? You never know if, uh, you'll never know if you don't ask. True enough. So where is it? Uh, number three building. Okay. Alright. I'll leave it up to you. Yep. I'll try not to. Later. Moshi moshi. I think. Alright, number three by the park. They're trying to get him to come back. I wonder if we'll face the fake Ryu Gota that we saw in the, um, in the, uh, uh, oh no, I think I killed him. I think I killed him with a tiger. We got a lot of stuff to do. <laughs> so now we have to figure out what going down with the real. I wonder if hopefully it's taking me straight there. I don't like. God dang it! It's not. <laughs> Well, it's not that far away, I guess. I 
got to walk slow behind these guys. I don't want to fight them right now. I want to get to the bottom of this mission and at least do one more side quest. Beforehand, thank goodness they're not turning. Take off! So it's right here. Alright, let's go in. This is where the clan's supposedly gathering. Get in there. Here goes nothing. I figured out what these guys are after. Is it perhaps Ryu Goda? Could it be? <laughs> Could they be after Ryu Goda? I don't know. That's a good question. And probably the answer. Oh. All right. Huh? Wh wh who are you? Yeah, what you staring at? You guys are the ones saying you revived the Go Ryu clan? You think you're hot shit, dickhead? Oh! <laughs> Alright, last chance. Any of you saying you'll revive the Go Ryu clan? Can I help you with something? Who are you? Hey, you barged into the man's office and you don't even have the decency to greet him? I'm the Go Ryu clan's third patriarch. Can't say I recognize you. Had some dealings with you guys back when the second patriarch was still around. That makes sense. Yeah. I took uh, my plead at the end of that era. It's no surprise you wouldn't know me. You'll have to excuse me, but who are you exactly? You've heard of Akami, right? She sent me. Ah, Akami, you say. I've heard she's been, she's well informed, but for her to have sniffed out our location, I suppose it must be true. Yeah, so half truths won't cut it. Better watch what you say. Oh, how scary. You know... I've been thinking, we ought to pay her a visit, say hello after all. We're new in town here. Do the Omi higher-ups know about your gra you guys? Not yet, but I plan to drop in on them as soon as a few gifts in hand. With a few gifts in hand. Even they won't say no to us. After the death of the sacred patriarch Gota in Kamurocho, the Goryu clan has dismantled for a time. Ugh, oh, they staged a coup against a main branch, after all. However, those of us who remain still aspire to reign supreme. We haven't forgotten the second patriarch's ambition. Scattered through where we were, we patiently bided our time for more than a decade. Until the until at last, the day has come to mobilize the Goryu clan once more. World's been getting a, word's been getting around that the goat is still alive. Not to mention, there's been multiple people impersonating him. You guys have something to do with that? Mm. Yeah, indeed. It's accomplished. Uh, it's according to plan. Upon our return to the city, the name Ryu Goda wouldn't serve as a monstrous weapon. Mm. However, as the second patriarch is no more, I decided it would just be as effective to install his illusion here instead. So he scattered these imposters all over town. Correct! And the name Ryu Goda echoes across the city. In that, in that chaos, the third generation of Ryu Goda clan, the ones behind it all, will ascend to Sotenbori's throne once again. Heh <laughs> heh <laughs> not a bad plan if I do say so myself. I see. It's all clear to me now. Clear that you aren't fit to bear the crest of the Ryu Goda family. Oh, shit! <sighs> Go ahead. Restore the clan if you want. That's got nothing to do with me. But using a deal or using a dead man's image as a mascot without a silver. Oh, what the, what the heck happened there? What is happening? Why is this controller keep da 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 da? Fuh. Fuh. Okay. <laughs> okay. I won't allow that. You won't allow it. Heh. <laughs> and just who do you think you are? I don't need to explain myself that. I don't need to explain myself to you. Huh, very well. It's been long enough for conversation, but there's a law last matter we ought to clear up. I think I mentioned it already, making ourselves a little visit to Akami. It would be the height of indiscretion for me not to bring her a gift. Your freshly served head would quite do nicely as a, that regard. It'll serve as a message. This is what happens when you go against the Go Ryu clan. Huh. It's all yours if you could take it. And besides, something like that wouldn't phase her. You never know if you don't try, right? Alright, boys, get him! Alright, 
You think I'm scared of you guys? Hey guys, how's it going? Hey, you have a gun? Goodbye. <laughs> You're the first one to go down. Here we go! Boom! That dude just stand. Could you get off the desk, sir? There we go, that was huge. Oh my god! <laughs> Alright. I don't know who I'm hitting with this, but someone's getting couched. Someone's getting big old couched. How did I hit you in while well, there's like super armor and shit like that? What? Give me this. Wait, there's a dude with a gun! Oh, I dodged him. Sick. I want to look at the other guy. He has a gun. He's much more threatening. Oh, you think you're cute, huh? You think you're cute? This chair says otherwise. Oh, we're getting to a slugfest again. All right, all right, I see you. Okay, okay, all right. Oh, you wanna stop anytime soon? My guy, Jesus! Get the fudge out of here! This guy. Oh my god, that dude freaking sucks. Ugh. We'll leave town. Please go easy on us. Giving up already. Yet another example of how unfit you are for the re Go Ryu tenants. Ugh. You better leave the town by today and don't ever come back. Or else I'll kill you. I'll kill you all. You all will get it. Get it. Got it. C -c -c Good. Alright, hopefully we got enough money to get a million. Then we'll go talk to that other guy and get him recruited to the team. Get that story done. Figure out what the other story we have going on. And... <laughs> God, I'm just looking over the video where I I have to do cabaret. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so bad. I'm so I have no riz. I would I didn't think that she would want me to be a freak, you know? I didn't think that. Why would she want me to be a freak? I guess hey, Japanese women, different breed, I guess. Alright, I see. Close call then, I guess. Uh and those Ryugotas were fake fake plants and the go ryu won't be coming back yep awesome work joyu for real though it would be oddly enthusiastic about the whole affair what gives the state of the go ryu clan is none of my business but i can't stand by and watch them tarnish a man's reputation and for pretty bleh, extortion and the blacksmith scam who's ryu goda did you know him or something something like that huh well whatever Anytime, or anyhow, that's taken care of now. I'll be looking forward to your help out in the next one, whenever the mood strikes. Did I stick my nose where it don't belong, Ryu? Heh, <laughs> us dead celebrate celebrities gotta work out, gotta look out for one another, huh? And the Ryu goes looking down from heaven. Ah, oh, 50 death, let's go, we got enough. Dang, that was a big hefty one, and now let's go pay that dude the money, get done with that one, try to finish one more maybe, wrong button. <laughs> I'm just the king of missed inputs, huh? It was a misclick, it was a misclick, I swear, a misclick! Okay, uh, let's go here now. Just gotta get, get out of here. Just gotta get out of here. You don't see me? We're cool? They don't recognize me since I changed my clothes. I'm out of here! No! Run! Go, 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 go! I'm stuck on- No! 
Oh, run! Run! Hurry! I do not wish to fight anymore. Hey, buddy. I have the a million yen you're looking for, yep. Hand over the million yen. I have a million yen for you, bud. Nani? But you're a complete stranger. Why would you help me? Think of it as down payment. And don't worry about it. Are you absolutely sure? I'm offering you a wad of cash. Don't overthink it. No. I can't accept this. I'm telling you. It's nothing. No. It's not like that. I just... The thought of holding so much money makes me nervous. Would you mind handing it to the foreman yourself? Guess I got no choice. Alright. I'll take it to him. Thank you. Sorry for... Sorry for the added trouble. Where's the foreman? Tell me he's not soup. Where is the... Oh, he's right over here. Okay, good. Eh, 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 eh. Something tells me this ain't gonna go right. Huh? Huh? Who are you? An acquaintance of, uh, Nono Kawai. Kawa. I bought this on his behalf. What the? We discussed it. He said... This is the remaining amount he owes you. Forgive me for asking, but what's your stake in all this? I need him for something, but he said he wouldn't leave until he paid you back. In other words, you want him to go to work, or you want him to go work for you? In a manner of speaking, yes. Well, I hate to break it to you, but this ain't gonna cover it. What? That kid's broken stuff, expensive stuff, and with the hammer more than just one time. This story doesn't match what he said. The guy owes me much more than this. And with interest on top. Dude, shout out to the the kappa in the background. Alright. I'd say over about 10 million yen by now. Got any proof of this? Yeah. Calling me a liar or something? You calling me a liar or something? Obviously. Won't fork up the cash? No. I see. Well, you're forcing my hand. Are you gonna fight me? Nanakawa, help! Huh? What's this about, boss? Everything okay? This man, he threatened me. Said he won't pay me, and I don't do as he says he'll kill me. Your true colors, huh? What? How dare you threaten my benefactor? I trusted you. Joy you. They won't end up recognizing you once I'm done with you. He's really lost it. This guy could be trouble. Snap out of it, Nonokawa. Sultan boy, civil- Oh, repeat- Don't say civilian. All right, here we go. Come on. Oh, you know, I should probably heal up. <laughs> Dang, I can't knock him over. Ooh, ooh, ooh. God dang. I need to find where I can block again, like after getting my block fucked up. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, oh! <laughs> All right, I deserve that. I didn't think he would do that. Ah! Oh! Pick up the hammer. Pick it up. It's mine now. You made your mistake. Huh? What are you doing, Nanakiwa? Go on, beat this guy to a pulp already. Huh? Huh? But what do you mean, but? The only thing that numbskull like you should worry about is what I freaking tell you. Boss? That's it. You absolute waste of space. Don't you ever call me boss again. That's some way to speak to a man who idolizes you. You think I give a shit? <laughs> I'll, pluck an, I'll pluck another dumb shit drop out from whatever the fuck and trick him into thinking he owes me money. Boss? Huh. I figured that's how it was. Why, boss? Hey, everybody! No, Kiwa said he's leaving. Time we show him a servitude. Alright. I ain't afraid of any of y'all, to be honest. Boss, how could you? I trusted you. Ah! Hey, watch my back, Joe. You. Huh. I get the sense I can't hold you back now. Let's do this. We got a bro for the bromance. <coughs> Here we go. Goodbye. 
Get in the river, dang it! How do I make you go in the Whoa! Here we go. God, why do you have more health than the brute that, you know? Is it because he's older? Someone taught me? Come on, go! Yeah, we did it! <laughs> Should be an achievement, right? There it is! God, that was one of the harder achievements. What the fudge? <laughs> what is wrong with this control gun? God. I, you know when I was like, maybe I should switch to another control, switch to my other controller? No, the other controller is fucking busted. Oh! 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 Oh, I missed it. Alright, alright, okay, okay, alright. Thanks, big guy, thanks, big guy. Oh, he's going in. Oh, you got me. Alright. Now you made me angry. God, that was funny. It sounded like, eh, eh, and then it just fell over, eh. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. Please, I beg you. Alright, and the money boss? All lies from the start. Leave, you're free to do whatever you want. I'm out of here! Ugh. Getting emotional? <laughs> no, <laughs> just laughing at my own stupidity. Joey san initially you approached me to recruit me for something. Yeah, feelings that on a matter haven't changed. Allow me to return the favor. My hammer, and I w will smash the whole world for you. Nice, we got yours! He's gonna be good. Glad to have you on board. Dang, I lied. Oh, do I still have- I still have my money! Yes! Yes! Also, ow, everything hurts. Oh, I don't need sake. What do I gotta do for you? Who are you? Oh, this is the guy. Okay, okay, I remember who this is. What do you want? Do you happen to know a guy named uh, um, Matsura? Matsura, effin' Matsura. So you do know him. That bastard, the whole damn reason I landed in this mess. Spun me some fairy tale about how he'd cancel all my debts then made off with everything I had. Can you tell me more? Just thinking about it boils my blood. Uh, wormed his way into my life. Then I was at wit's end after our orphanage had fallen into debt. Your orphanages. Let me handle it, he said. Promised he could sell me, sell it off for a bunch, but that slime ball plan to rip it, rip off our land right from the start. Matsua, devils in disguise. Uh, and you were left homeless. Ain't me you ought to worry about. Story ain't over yet. What do you mean? Matsua hired these kids who would come out of nowhere to g go at his company. Said he'd look after him. Really made it seem like they were trying to help out. But ha uh, now I hear he won't even let them leave the office. He works them like cart horses. Seriously? My precious kids. Worse yet, they say they've gotten close ties to the Yakuza. My luck ran out the day I signed. Or they the sights on me. It's too late for me. I'm to blame for letting him manipulate me with his forked tongue. But hey, buddy, don't know who you are, but if it's in your power, all I ask is that you save those kids. Uh. I will. And I should reach out to, to Akami better than staying out here. Or you should reach out to her, yep. Ask the other homeless around you. They'll tell you where, where to go, explain what happened. They won't ignore you. Akami, yeah, I've heard of it. Thanks, buddy. No problem. I'm so sorry that you... Wow, that's...
So now we know he's a freaking loser. God, then you f freak with kids like that? That's weird. Uh, that also sounds weird the way I said it. Whatever. How'd it go, Joe? You heard the guy's story. He said he would run the orphanage till he robbed him of everything he owned. I see. Apparently, he's also found an approach or approaching older people without families so they can make off with their assets. He's gotten sloppy and all of his wicked's going on behind my back. Mm. Why didn't you come out? Why didn't this come to light earlier? Folks f uh, who use loan sharks are generally a wanton to make a little profit too. Bet he's using that as leverage to make his victims feel like they owe him. Not to mention people who won't tally on you make for excellent pawns. It sounds like uh, his company exploits kids from the orphanages he destroys. There's a boy named that guy <laughs> living in the signet who really idolizes him. I bet the other kids feel the same way. Uh, I bet the other, yep. You mean, yeah. That's probably why he targets orphans as a convenient, convenient source of work. <sighs> Akami, I need you to tell me where to find him. Give me a minute. Here we go. It's an office called his... Well, that's obvious in in the Nishikubi Sunrise Building in South Shokifuko. I don't know why you always call it Sho, Shofuko. It does, man. Yep. I'll head right over there and I'll deal with it. That's what he said. I'm paraphrasing. Alright, so this is the last thing we're going to do. Where? Am I blind? Am I blind? No, oh, I am blind. <laughs> it's right there. All right, cool. Mushy, mushy. Do I have any keys while I'm here? Might as well check. I think I got one. Nope. No, don't got any. All right, cool. Good to know. Oh, sh no, 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 no. It's not that. Okay, fine, fine. Come here. Who's gonna be the first to fall here? Oh! Uh! I don't need the. I don't need to know how to taunt. I'm good. I just beat the tar out of all these into. He's gonna throw him at me. I love that one. That one's so funny. All right, you knife boy. You think you're clever with your knife? Yeah, you suck. Nice try. Oh, it's Soma! Dude, that game was crazy. I need to get back to doing shorts about it. Alright. Hey, right, come here. We're gonna do this. Boosh! You're done, son. Tema Toma Nama Nama Tomatios. I got moved around. Here we go. We need to deal with. Is it through here? Is it up here? No. Is it through here? It's here? It's here. Must be his office. Time to pay him a visit and destroy him for being a dickhead. Got it, rookie? The only answer I want to hear from you is yes, sir, and understood. Before long, you'll be one of us. But until then, we're going to learn you real good. Nanny. Hey, lay off of him. Huh? Who the fuck you come barging in here like that? Tell me something. Is rough up your employees just business as usual around here? Yeah, got a problem with that? Get that shithead out of here before... It, <laughs> Getting the shit beat out of here is the fastest way to learn. No, I don't think so. You, We play by our own rules. You ain't one of us, asshole, so butt out. He used asshole and butt in the same sentence. Interesting. That's kind of crazy. What office supplies? Well, now I kind of want to see what this looks... <laughs> what this uh, heat action with that would be. Bitch! 
Oh! Boop a doo. Got him. Hey, how's it going? You okay, man? Boy. Oh, are you all right? Oh, uh, you're you're that guy that Mr. Isan saw, Joe Yusan, right? I guess he he hired you. What happened here? It was all my fault. I kept making dumb mistakes and giving him shitty answers. That's not something that warrants violence. Just please don't tell him. If I don't want to, I don't want to cause him any trouble. Why are you so loyal to him? Cause he's been good to me. We ain't got no parents, but he treats me like a son. Of course, I look up to him. Looks like my prediction was right. Missouri wins over orphanage just so he can use them like pawns. Ta, ah, come on. Tell me where he is. Why? What are you gonna do? I won't cause you any trouble for you. Ah, he's like a father to me. If you're planning to hurt him, you'll just have to go through me first. Back then, back when I was 20 or so, I wouldn't have hesitated to give my life for kazuma son either. But something, someone once told me that that sort of thing was just brainwashing. I see. How about you stay here and get a little rest, rest a bit, or head for the hospital, all right? Joe, you son. I'm walking away, bitch. Big old bitch. It's just crazy how, like, I understand that dynamic and everything, but it's just so wild you know it's one of those things where what is it called um oh, i was about to say the mandela effect but that's not it it's it's like brainwashing but it's oh, i forget what it's called there's a there's a name for it but i'm too stupid right now i took psych class once all right i know i know about the mind and thinking and all that stuff the manhattan project nope not that <laughs> i don't know We'll just call it brainwashing for now. That sounds fine. So now I have to figure out where he is. Oh yeah, just in case it wasn't obvious. Once this is done, we're ending the episode because it's gone on for about an hour. That's a little bit longer than I wanted. I can't believe this type of heinous shit going down in Okazawa right now. Right under my nose. This is all my fault. You don't need to shoulder it so much, Blaine. Bleh. <laughs> More importantly, though, do you know where he is? He wasn't at his office. Wait a second. Got it. Looks like he's in the park. On my way. I'm gonna give it to him so good. Pause. <laughs> no cap. <laughs> no, wait, no. Wait, what? <laughs> what did the kids say? Let's just take a taxi. Here. I don't know if it's faster, but I have a million yen, and I don't, I don't care. I do not care. It is so nice, yes. To just go and just not walk, and just, your taxi driver takes you everywhere, yes. So are we going to beat him up? What do you think we're going to do? We're gonna call him out. We're gonna call him sus and kick him in the ass. Into space. Oh, come on. There's no reason us for us to fight, men. There's no reason. Yes, that's right. Turn around. Do 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 <gasps> There we go. Don't give it to him. Yeah. Joey Kuhn has an honest determination that's hard to find nowadays. Sure, the kids would be hesitant at first, but soon they'll be growing to love him as a director. And with him at the role, Signet would, would be able to stand against its financial pressures. He'll need support, of course, but that's where my expertise comes in. There's nothing to worry about. Joey Kuhn and I can get Signet back on our feet. What do you think? Any downsides to my proposal? I guess not exactly right. In that case, wait. Aww. Hello, Joe Yukun. 
I was just uh, about to contact you. <laughs> about what? The director finally come to his decision. He wants you to take over Signet. Oh. This is your first time running an institution, right? I understand any concerns. But please, just relax. I'll take care of the tough stuff, just like the operations and finances. Makes it easier to snatch the deed to the land and the building, right? Mm -hmm. Huh? What is this now? Yeah. Joey Kuhn, what are you about all of a sudden? You know that's not true. All I know is that your spe all I know is that it's your specialty, Mr. Lone Shark. Lone Shark? Uh. Akami tipped uh tipped off lead me oh. Tip off led me to one of your victims, another orphan's director apparently. You offered to help him settle his debt, and then you took everything he owned, leaving him destitute. He still hates your guts. What are you saying? No, you're completely mistaken. It is true that I also work as a debt adjuster, but that type of work tends to be rocky in practice. Of course, I did everything I could for that man, but he still ended up losing his property. I just can't believe he, blame, he would blame me for everything. For argument's sake, let's just say I accept your excuse. But what about Takumi? Takumi? I dropped by your office. They were too, they were beating on him when he got there. Takumi, why, why would that be? This kid even believed that it was his fault, was worried he'd cause trouble. Well, that must be, he must have made some sort of mistake. It's no wonder why you hire kids from your institution. Duh, time to fess up. You approach Signet because you're a loan shark and you're at an eye for, on the building and land. Plus, you wanted to acquire more pawns. Pawns? What do you mean? <laughs> nice detective work, Joe Yukun. Guess the cat's out of the bag. Children know nothing of the world. Put on a good show for them and it's not long till they're wrapped around your finger. If I make if I make use of clueless pawns, I can extend my reach and collect even more. <laughs> what you think? Pretty clever, right? What do you... So, your backstory is gro growing up in Sunflower Pool bull bullshit too? That was part true. In fact, there was original inspiration for all this plan. What? Don't you remember what I said about Kazuma guy who ran the Sunflower? He was actually a Yakuza. And a very clever man. He was the founder of an orphanage that he played, yeah, he played on people's sympathies. But from the shadows, he created an army of obedient puppets who were willing to die for him. Uh, if I remained at Sunflower, the same thing would have happened to me as, the, or it happened to me. I ran as soon as I was wised up. Is that, is that what you meant by following in Kazuma's footsteps? Don't you get me? <laughs> everything he did, everything I've done. What's the difference? Taking advantage of the weak and creating an army of willing slaves? <laughs> he was a great teacher. You bastard! I don't understand what you're, why you're so upset, but that's enough chit-chat. Wow, you just have your men here? Oh, tell me I get to kick your ass too. You. Yeah. If you're gonna blame someone, Joe Yu, you blame yourself for meddling. If you hadn't stuck your nose into my business, you wouldn't have to die. I ain't afraid of you. You're no. You look at you. You have only a yellow bar of health. You're, you're worthless. Oh come on! I hate how it just. Whoa! How did you get back on your feet so fast, sir? Bam! Oh yeah! I didn't even. I didn't even think I had the heat for that, but I did. <laughs> Shout out to this guy who doesn't know what he's doing. What do you, what's up, what, you okay, bud? Oh, bam! <laughs> oh, you threw water at me? Alright, you want to get piped? I was a plumber in my before life. Because I'm a professional at laying pipe. Alright. Come here. I just want to talk to you with my pipe. God dang, I just boosted on him. He boomed it on you, man. Anybody know where that reference is from? <laughs> ah, uh, shit. Joe Yukun, I apologize. Look, man, I'm sorry. So, come on, won't you forgive me? Don't try and warm your, <laughs> worm your way out of this. 
you gotta listen. You don't, you don't do this because I, I don't do this because I want to. I'm a victim too. My parents, Cosmo, murdered them. Yeah. I was so clueless, but one day I stumbled upon the truth. I pressed Cosmo for answers. Told him he was a hypocrite. He said nothing. So I escaped the orphanage, but I never stopped hating him. To be raised by the man who murdered my real parents? Who can accept that? I'm not the villain here. It's all Cosmo's fault. Huh? <laughs> uh. I'm certain Cosmo knew better than anyone what a hypocrite he was. But he was nothing false or hypocritical about the love he poured into those kids. And that is something I know better than anybody. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Look at him. Look at the dude in the background. Even you must have felt his sincerity. If you if you're that clueless, then you should watch what you say about Kazuma. Uh. Uh. Anyways, uh, I'll leave the rest to you. I'm on it. By the way, on the topic of his employees, Jerry san can I can I tell you? Wait, whoa. Can I ask you to tell them they're welcome at Signet? Huh? Those children need some peace of mind. If anything, we do have plenty of empty rooms. Director, thank you. It's really us who ought to be thanking you. God, screwing with kids, that's, that's a dickhead. I overheard his proposal. I actually think that's a great idea. They still got a whole heap of problems, but it'll help them as much as I can. Thanks, I'm counting on you. See you. And we're gonna see. It's like, they did this for you, Cosmo. Guess no matter whose footsteps you choose to follow, the journey is what you make of it. If Cosmo san could see me now, I wonder what he'd say. Nice! Half a milli? Good. Alright, but like I said, this is where we're gonna end it. Thank you all so much for coming out and ch checking out the video. I stumbled through my words there. I apologize. I do hope you enjoyed. Uh, like and sub if you did, and I'll catch you in the next one. Toodaloo.